my name is Tim. We're franchisees in Lafayette, Indiana. Uh, we started in June of 2012. We had searched franchises a few years ago, a few years before we got into Kona, and uh, didn't really see anything that, that fit us that well. Uh, my wife suggested that we try looking at franchises again. So I went to Google, I typed in franchise, uh, Kona came up, and 30 days later I was driving a truck home. We like the idea of the community give back. We like the idea that, hey, this can make us money. You know, it can be something that can provide income uh, far into the future for us. Kona College was great. Of course, it was at, uh, near the beginning. It was great that uh, Richie was there because we asked him a lot of questions and we learned a lot of things. Uh, that's so important for new franchisees. There's a wealth of information. Use the forum, call franchisees up. There's a lot you can learn before you have to make a mistake and learn it that way. Well, that summer it didn't rain for 64 days after we got our truck, so I was in the truck every day. It was very hot, very dry, which was great for business. Although it was nice, uh, finally that fall I hired an employee, so I, I did take a day off, and that was great. As the weather turned colder, it's like, okay, we're gonna, we're gonna be done for a while. And that's when they came out with the Mini. And I really, it's like nice, but I really did not think it was, you know, that's something that we needed to do. Uh, my wife said, yeah, we should get the Mini. So we got the Mini. Uh, ended up being one of the best things we ever did. Uh, we got a lot of uh, bookings from it. It helps to build relationships with people when you're standing next to them instead of over them. We do a pretty good neighborhood business. Uh, Sundays are really good in neighborhoods for us. And uh, the first year we started, uh, one of the Sundays was my birthday. Well, I'm, I love to work, so that's what I did on my birthdays. I got my Kona truck. You're welcome. And one of my customers, uh, regular customers on my Sunday route, I've uh, got two little boys. You know, they drew me a happy birthday Kona man picture. Uh, you know, so I'm sitting there on the truck trying not to cry when they give it to me. They're trying to pay me for Konas. I can't take their money. Uh, that was a great thing. Uh, and, and these are little kids, maybe three and five years old. Uh, later on in the winter, we saw them uh, at a store here in town, and the little boy ran up to me and gave me a hug. You know, there, there's no other business you can be in where parents are going to let kids run up to people and just give them hugs. Uh, you know, that's, that's one thing that sets Kona apart. We have four boys, so my wife just does a wonderful job making sure they're all where they're supposed to be. I try to get to all their activities as much as I can. I uh, wish I could be at all of them. Uh, and then sometimes they help me on the truck too, so that's always fun when we can do events together. Yeah, Renee does a great job with uh, the Instagram. Uh, of course, she made nice signs to go on the side of the truck for it. Uh, my drivers promoted it. Uh, when we were notified that we were the winner, uh, I didn't know the customer. Uh, it was on one of my driver's regular routes, and uh, he immediately knew who it was. Uh, he was excited for her. Uh, and it was just as simple as, hey, do you want to win $1,000? Do you want to win a t-shirt? Uh, and people are having fun with it.
Well, one thing I, I think that's important that I want to teach my kids is that no matter what job you do, you're going to have to work hard. You have to make the phone call that you're afraid to make. Uh, you have to make the sales call that you're afraid to make. You have to deliver results that are exceptional every time. You have to succeed when failure is an easy thing to do. No matter what industry you're in, you're going to have challenges. You know, find something you're passionate about and go after. Uh, I could have a headache. I could be having a bad day. I could be tired. I get in the truck and it has like healing powers. Like I, I feel good. I'm not tired. You know, and it's it's a lot of fun because you know you're making your customers happy.